Right, for this covering tutorial, you're going to learn how to finish a large balsa wood wing with just a few simple materials, glues and tools. You'll need these items to get started, especially the Easy Dope Solution Glue, which shrinks and seals the tissue skin, and the UHU Glue Stick, which can smear a nice thin layer of glue to your wooden airframe parts. Pins are also necessary to keep your model flat on a building board later on. A paintbrush is essential for this process, so make sure you have one of those, along with, of course, the tissue itself. For larger aircraft which can cope with the added weight, go for heavier gram stuff for added strength. Step 1. Take your freshly sanded wing component and set it down on your building table. Next, unfold your tissue and cut it to size. I like to cut several pieces at this stage so that the step doesn't have to be repeated later. Step 2. Create a mixture of wood glue and water. This should be around a 50-50 mix. If you make it too watery, you can simply top it up with some more glue. Step 3. Run the glue stick around the perimeter of the wing, missing out the internal ribs. Hold the stick at a 45 degree angle to get a very thin smearing of glue along the edges. Now you can lay down your first piece of tissue. Tug at the sides to remove the wrinkles. The tip here is to pull at it lengthways first before stretching it along the cord of the wing. If needed, you can remove some excess now with a knife or scissors. Step 4 is to fully adhere the edges of the tissue to the edges of the wing with the wood glue mix. This is essential for keeping the tissue skin securely fixed in place for when we water shrink it later on. Okay, now you can repeat the process on the top side of the wing. I like to cover the bottom side first as it tends to be flatter and therefore ever so slightly easier. Again, you can cut away excess with a sharp knife. This wing tip can be a bit tricky as it has a contoured compound curve. So here I decided it would be easier to apply separate pieces both to the leading edge and trailing edge curves. Okay, now we can get to the shrinking phase. This is where you shrink the skin of your model to make it super tight like a drum over the frame of your aircraft. First create about a 5% easy dope, 95% water mix in an atomizer spray bottle. Second, create some spacers from scrap balsa wood and wrap them in tape to keep them from sticking to your wing. 
Now you can lightly mist the mix over both the top and bottom wing surfaces. After this, you can place pins at the edges of the wing to hold it down over your spaces to ensure that the wing dries straight without any warpage going on. It will look a bit wrinkly and soggy now, but leave it to dry for around 12 to 24 hours and you'll come back to a tight skin stretched by the water evaporation and secured in place by the Easy Dope. An optional next step is to create a stronger mix of Easy Dope and paint it over the top of the wing to create an even more dope infused skin that will add more strength. Again the surface here can go a little soggy but it will dry nice and tight. With that you can add your wing to the model. Thanks very much for watching this video. Let us know what processes for covering models you prefer in the comments below. Also make sure to check out the new Balsa Cub on our store and we'll see you on the next video.